showing you guys how you can make some DIY room decor inspired by the all magical unicorn. If you've stumbled across my channel and you're wondering who I am, then hello, my name is Jillian and I love the color pink and unicorns and rainbows and coffee and my cat. And I am so excited to meet you and I'm so happy that you found my channel. And if you would love to see more videos from me in the future, then just go ahead and subscribe by clicking the red subscribe button. And then whenever I upload a new video, you're gonna be able to see it. You can tell I'm excited about today's video because I'm talking with my arms a lot and my rings keep wanting to like fly off across the room. <laughs> I can't wait to share with you all these magical and fun DIYs. So I think it's time that we jump into the video. The first unicorn DIY that we're going to be creating today is this adorable unicorn clock and I love it so much because it looks like she's wearing a flower crown. So starting off you're going to need some clock making pieces and I found these at the craft store and then I just went ahead and painted the clock base and I painted mine white but you can paint yours whichever colour you like. Next taking some colourful paper I began cutting out little flower shapes and I did two different sizes which I later glued together so my flowers would have more more dimension so I just went ahead and made a bunch of different colors now when making your decorations for your clock you want to make sure that the decorations are as flat as possible so that your clock hands can move around freely so here I am just gluing my two little flowers together and they're already looking super cute and I just finished them off with a little rhinestone in the middle now for the unicorn horn I decided to use some super sparkly gold paper and I just sketched a little unicorn horn shape first and then cut this out now for the unicorn lashes I just took some black cardboard and folded this in half and I did this so that I would get two lashes the exact same when I cut them out now these looked a little bit plain to me so I just added some black glitter to make them nice and sparkly next it's time to put all the pieces together to make the unicorn so I just started gluing all the pieces on and I also added some cute little foam ears I also decided to add some green leaves between the flowers just to make it a bit more colorful and make the flowers pop then I stuck on the lashes and just put my my clock together with all the clock pieces and this was the finished result it is so cute it's definitely the coolest clock I've ever seen and I'm so happy with it up next we are going to be making a unicorn themed rug and I've actually never made a rug on my channel like I've never decorated one before so this was so much fun and I found this rug at Ikea a while back and it's super plain and super boring and I remember seeing it and thinking I could totally decorate that and make it into something cool but I just hadn't found a use for it until this video so I grabbed the rug and I decided to write a little unicorn quote on it and I did hashtag unicorn vibes so it started off with a pencil and I just sketched out the letters just so I would have a guide as to where I wanted the letters to go to make sure they're all going to fit and not get squished and then I grabbed all my fun unicorn colors I just used acrylic paint but you could also use fabric paint and I started painting on this white rug and then waited for it to dry I am so happy with how this rug turned out. I have such a boring carpet, so adding this rug to the floor just makes such a difference and it's so perfect for Instagram pictures and I love all the bright colors and honestly, hashtag unicorn vibes is my new life motto. <laughs> now it's time to make a unicorn themed cushion and there are honestly so many different ways to make a unicorn cushion, but I felt like I needed to do a DIY centered around the magical unicorn horn because after all, well, that is where the unicorn gets all its magic from. Starting off with a plain cushion cover, I first sketched a outline of a unicorn horn just so that I would have a guide. Next, I took a bunch of different gems and these are the sparkliest and prettiest things ever and I've been wanting to use them for so long. So what better time to use them than to create a unicorn horn. So I just started gluing all the gems onto the cushion cover and I did four different colors in total just to make it look more special and fun. Once all the gems were secured and the glue was completely dried, I just took a cushion insert and placed it inside the cushion cover and then I popped this front and center on my bed because it was so beautiful and when the gems were hit by the sunlight, they glistened just like a real unicorn horn would. I loved all the different magical unicorn colors and this was super easy to make but I think it's so effective. 
Now for my favorite unicorn DIY of them all, we are going to be making the cutest unicorn banner ever and everything about this banner is just so adorable and perfect. So first you're going to need a plain canvas banner and I found this at a craft store but you could totally make one yourself. So I started off by sketching out a triangle which is going to be the unicorn horn and then taking some really pretty gems. I just started gluing all the gems inside the triangle to make the perfect unicorn horn shape. Now that we have our magical unicorn horn, we can go on to create the rest of the unicorn face. So I used felt for my banner and I started off by making the ears. So I folded a piece of white felt in half just so that I would get two ears the exact same shape. And I just cut out some little ear shapes and then I also did the same with pink felt but just did them slightly smaller to go inside the ears. And then using black felt, I just made some more pretty unicorn lashes. Next, using some fabric glue, I just began gluing all the essential parts of our unicorn onto the unicorn banner. So I started off with the ears and then I took these really pretty little flowers that I found at the craft store in the most perfect unicorn colors and I glued these on under the unicorn horn and this blended the ears and the unicorn horn and everything together. Next, I took the eyelashes and put these on as well. These are my favorite style of eyelashes on anything unicorn, so that's why you see it a lot in this video but they just look so adorable so this is the end result of our unicorn banner it's magical it glistens it sparkles it's got flowers it's just perfect and I seriously want to keep this forever because it just makes me so happy oh I love it so much How adorable was that unicorn banner? I am so obsessed with it. If you're looking for something else to watch, I think you'll love the video that I've linked over here. It's so much fun. Thank you all so much for watching today's DIY video. I love you all so, so much, and I will see you all in my next video.